hey guys welcome to my channel so in this video i'm going to talk about aur helper and if you guys don't know what aur helper is well i think you you are not aware about arch linux or manjaro linux but if you are someone who know what aur is well uh, then you know that it's a like a repository created by arch users and it's a pretty neat way to install programs not really but yeah it's better than ubuntu ppa so uh, in this video i'm going to talk about a really minimalist um, aur helper so before that let's just see some aur helpers which is basically means like um, um package manager so these are like some secondary package manager and it's even i mean it's good but um i don't like this that's why i just want to move to gen 2 and before moving to gen 2 i just want to make this video to just you know show things which i do in my arch or rtx right now i'm using rtx because you know rtx have open rc but that's a different story so these are like some uh i guess yeah these are some aur helpers so this pakku i use this pakor i i actually use every almost every one of them these are good these are really good but one year ago i found a really really nice bash script which can be you know used as an aur helper and it's it contain everything and it's just it's just amazing i mean i love minimalism so that's why i just love this so let me show you so this is bop so bop is a basic aur package helper and it contain everything whatever you want literally i am using this for like one year and i never had any issue i had issue in these aur helper i had an issue installing these aur helpers i got errors but bop is something which is pretty easy to install because it's just uh 300 lines long bash script and this is just man page this make file and read me so it contains everything like you can just you know it's so simple to install this first of all it contain a man page you can read so i'm going to just demonstrate you in this video also it's highly underrated as you can see it just only one star this is this is so underrated so I guess I found this while using Arch Lab, so I once tried installing this uh, Arch this Arch based distribution Arch Labs, and it was nice. Like if you want uh, out of the box Arch, even though I don't you know promote any um, Arch based distribution, I think it's better if you install Arch by your own. But uh, yeah, so I found this, and uh, let's just try this 300 line long um, Bash script. So isn't it amazing? Like you can do something in just three 300 line long bash script but uh, people still use like these bloated and right and for now like these uh, things are bloated for me so people use these like these so i don't know what to say so let's just you know try to install this it's not very hard it's actually pretty simple first you need to get clone the repo and then just cd and you know bop and then sudo make install so it's installed okay let's just try this so let's try installing some program let's let's just see first help page help like um what command we can use so we can see the versions or also we can do some search we can update we can install you know help and this is just basic stuff so let's see version all right this is the version by the way i just don't want this repo to end so i will back make a backup or just upload this on make a fork for myself so it's better if you make a fork because um it's pretty dead all right but it's working i have experience so uh taxi git so let's do this all right so uh, you have to write this minus i for install by the way so uh, it's going to ask like if you want to edit the pkg build which is a file which basically tells how to install some program like because you know in aur you compile your softwares and i don't like this by the way uh, for some programs you compile for some programs you just make uh, install binary packages so that's why i just want to move to gen 2 now and i think after my exams i will move so see it's so simple it's installed it just did what your ei was doing and it's just bash it's not a go implementation uh, also i can just search any package so like if you want to search something you can just search and then you can add, type any number like if you want to just install so it's such a simple way like i just love this package manager all right i use this a lot so 
I think it's better if I press that. Um, there are some more things uh, Bob can do. Like if you do minus U, it's first it's going to update your entire system, and the uh, next thing it's going to do is it's going to update your AUR packages. So uh, this is good. Just one command, and you can update everything in your system. So I like this. So now it's you know updating AUR packages. So you can see it's just doing its thing all right so i don't want to update anything okay so isn't that amazing like you can just uh you can just you know use this minimal package aur package helper and you're using these kind of programs which is not so minimal one more thing if you you know try this just give this report